So this one is problem 3.12 of Sadiku and as usual uh, we will pick the bottom most part of this circuit as ground and the question is determine determine V0 using nodal analysis V0 is here and naturally because we need to use nodal analysis and we need to find this I will pick this node here so the node that directly connected to V0 I name this as not A and let's start there so we need to do KCL at not A so what will we do next so we assume that the current is going here and then this current is going here so KCL said that the current that goes in is equal to the current that goes out there is two current that goes in this guy and this guy and for this guy, we need the value of this node. So let's just name that node as node B. So the current here is equal to VB minus VA divided by 100. And then plus this guy so the current is still with the current that goes in so that one is 4 i x and that's all of the current that goes in and this will equal to the current that goes out so the current that goes out is v a minus 10 oh sorry v a divided by 10 not minus 10 so so now we have ix here we will just rewrite this vb minus va over 100 plus 4 this one is ix now ix is the current here and the value is vb divided by 20 and this will equal to a over 10 <coughs> and now we will multiply both sides by 100 and we get this one vb minus va 100 times 100 they cancel each other and this one we need 20 and times 100 it's still 5 and we will have 20 VB and this part we multiply by 100 so we will have 10 VA now we are doing some math here VB plus 20 is 21 VB 21 VB and then okay we will have this one and we will move the VA there and uh, so we will have 11 VA now we are going to solve for VA as VA and V0 as really the same so we need to solve for VA so here we will have VB is equal to 11 over 21 VA let's save that as equation number one okay now what do we need to know this VB so naturally we will have to go this note to find out what VB is so we will check that so we will have to do KCL at node B We will have KCL at node B. So the voltage here is 20. Oh, sorry, not 20. That's 40. That's 40. Okay, and so we will have. The Should we assume that this current will go here? The current will go here, and that current will still go there. 
so we will have 40 minus VB divided by 20 and the current that goes out is equal to VB over 20 plus VB minus VA over 100 multiply both sides by 100 and we will have 200 minus 5 VB is equal to 5 VB plus VB minus VA and okay we will simplify this Okay, that one is 11 VB 200 is equal to this move there so 5 times 5 5 plus 5 is 10 10 plus 1 is 11 11 VB minus VA and now we are going to calculate this so this is equation 2 we will substitute this equation number 1 into equation number 2 so we will have 200 is equal to 11 times this VB is equal to that value 11 over 21 VA minus VA and ok we will solve that 200 is equal to 121 21 minus VA and this will be okay let's make some room here make some room and we will have 200 Well, this one is still have VA here is equal to that one is 21 over 21 so we will have 100 over 21 times VA and now we will have VA is 21 times 200 divided by 100 and we can cancel this into 2 and we will have value of VA is equal to 21 times 2 42 4 and now we are asked to solve for V0 V0 is basically equal to VA because this VA is between this and this and V0 is also between this and this so that's basically solve our problem that is 42 4 okay i hope i don't make any mistakes so thanks for watching let me know if you found any mistakes thank you for watching